I don't know if you can fish here. Same thing. Hey guys, welcome to the channel and thank you for stopping by. Last week I went with my daughter for a ride uh, to the alpaca farms and today we are heading out for another shorter ride uh, just down to Ship River Falls. That's uh, probably about 30 kilometers ahead of us here. It's a perfect day and at the same time I still I'm still testing the adjustment on the microphone because I seem not getting getting it right uh, it's always uh, still out of uh, it's still peaking when I'm uh, recording a video so right now I decrease the gain again and I hope that that will help a little bit with the sound but uh, we will find out and then the real check is going to be as always once I have it in my editing software. <music> Last day of August and we can see the signs of fall. The leaves are starting to turn yellow and that's a bad sign. I don't like it whatsoever. I do love fall uh, as a season because it's my favorite time to ride and also the colors are spectacular but that, that, that means only one thing that uh, the white crap is just around the corner and that's uh, what I don't like because the riding season number one the riding season will be over and uh, the older I get the more I hate the cold. My daughter, she's still enjoying it. She likes to play in the snow and build the snowmen and all that fun kid stuff. But myself, no, I'll pass. I'd rather have the warmth or at least the weather like today, which is awesome. It's uh, about 20 degrees. We still have the smoke that's blowing in here into Alberta from uh, British Columbia. Hopefully hoping to see some uh, mountain sheep They like to hang around in that area. So we'll see as uh, as we get closer to the Sheep River Falls uh, Provincial Park just got into Kananaskis Provincial Park it's a perfect day with the, when you're riding when you stop it's a bit warm it was raining here too it was raining in the city and it was raining here oh well, now you can see the mountains normally you can see them from the city but not here not not these days but uh, here you can but still not the best so we just came here to check out the campground because uh, that could be our potential camping spot maybe for next camping trips till this year. Looks like it's a pretty nice area. Might as well check it out. That goes down to the river I'm pretty sure. There is the river. Yeah, this one is a provincial campground. So but where's the normal campsite? I've seen the group area. Haven't seen the... I should go online and look up for the reservation here then. Okay, where is the normal campground? Because this, this is just for one day. We'll drive around here, we'll see. Yeah, it would be nice to come out here for a weekend. 
have a barbecue not far from home it's uh, like an hour or not even so those are the campsites pretty nice and there's no actually places available here believe it or not I gotta check it out for next weekend really that's a, also a trip to check out the campground that we haven't been at and there's another one up ahead there's a different campground look at how big are the sites nice oh I smell the fire so it looks like the fire is allowed they have the they have the electrical here too why not if there is yeah like this one is not bad looking site yeah there's quite a few vacant sites which is nice we'll check out the other loops uh, that will be the loop C for camping we'll check how those look there's some kind of a hiking trail but those ones they don't have power no they do have power so they are very similar to be honest those camp uh, campsites so this campground is called Sandy McNab and that's the first campground as we enter Ship River Falls so let's go check out the other ones there's a lot of poop on the road from cow poop how's the tow? You were here with me, though, you don't remember? And Mama, but we were in a car. Some time ago. Not be saved by rock and roll. You can take my money, steal my car. Sell my clothes. You can take the shoes I'm in. Go on, take everything. You can have about everything. So normally here we would see some mountain sheep, and I don't see them today for some reason. There's still chance to see them a little bit further down here up ahead. There is a viewpoint on the left. Bighorn viewpoint. Are they even here? Oh, just, oh wow, what a view up ahead. Look at the road from the top. Beautiful. Maybe we can go and pull up and take a little break where the cars are over there, huh? Go on, take all I own And I'll be fine I'll sit right here And pick my God It's good to know That I'll be safe I rock and roll You can hear them playing Every evening but You can hear them playing Every Let's day this. Let's check this inlet Where is that leading to? Exploring the whole ship river. Uh oh. Okay. It's not going, we're not gonna go anywhere far here. At this point, we're almost getting to the destination. Uh, it's, uh, it is on the la left side, at the ship river falls. So there's, there's just a small waterfall, so we will hang out there maybe for a little bit have a cookie sandwich and chill for a bit 
and then uh, from there we will continue to go towards uh, the other campground just up ahead which is uh, not really far it's just uh, I don't know two minutes maybe oh there is a Indian oils picnic area Ship River Falls. It should be right here on the left. So there we are. We made it to Ship River Falls and the falls are actually over there. It's a nice day, feels pretty good. The daughter has cookies and she's going of course to check out the water. It's a pretty cool canyon, just a little one. I gotta strip a layer out of my clothing because I am warm. You I'm gonna have to take my t shirt that I have underneath. In the morning, it started to get cool, and now it's uh, pretty warm actually. And <laughs> Natalie's chilling right on the table. Relaxing one more week before school starts. Don't even mention, it. Don't even mention that. Grade six, here I come. I'm so excited. No, you're not the excited. Of excited. You should be excited. Why? Get to see your friends again and teachers. No, maybe learn something new, hopefully. You never know. You had two months off, it was a blast. Too little. Ah, Alright, start dressing up ah. and uh, we will start rolling again. Because we're sitting here in the sun. And what are we doing here on the table? Sleeping. There's no sleeping. Time to rock and roll again. Putting all those boots, those tight boots, and go. Back to school, back to school. I got my lunch packed up. No, no I got my shoe tight tight. No, the, I, the first is I got my lunch packed up. I got my shoes tight tight. I hope I don't get in a fight. to check out here in uh, Ship River Falls and it is which is the campground just uh, two minutes up the road here so that campground up ahead it's called the Blue Rock campground which is right here so that's 1 to 13 yeah this one doesn't have any electricity or nothing This one is much smaller and it's much fuller too. Much more people in here. 
So this one is going to be a bigger problem to make the reservation. So I said that apparently those 20 sites, but no, this is actually another loop right here, which goes to 66. Oh, look at that cool little camper. I think so, yeah, that's a turn around loop. There's a hiking trail here too. Going down. Another hiking trail. It was a nice midday spent here in Ship River Falls. We didn't have any luck to spot the mountain goats or mountain sheep, however you want to call them. Uh, maybe on the way back there is still a chance here. But uh, we managed to chill a bit, walk around uh, the falls and, and now we have uh, 82 kilometers to get home. So that should be about an hour, around an hour. Not a long trip today. Didn't want it to make the kid too tired. the cows were they're like freaking mountain goats that's what we get to see instead of a mountain mountain goats we get to see the cows <laughs> climbing the rocks it's a alpine cows <laughs> they're very skilled <laughs> oh more cows more cows this one too They're eating machines. so stupid instead of going they're looking at you yeah of course they're little ones fluffy ears all right guys so that will be it for today uh, we're exiting the park and 64 kilometers to get home but once I'm out of the park there's not much more worthwhile to film if you like that video, don't forget to hit the like button. 
comment down below and subscribe for more future content similar to this and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers!